In this way, you've tracked down your twin flame. How superb! You are invigorated, desirous, and energetic. There's only one issue. Should you tell them how you feel? Tragically, there can be a great deal of vulnerability in this exceptionally close inquiry. Luckily, I have some uplifting news. There are a large number of reasons why telling your twin flame how you feel is smart. We should investigate 10 of them, and ideally assist with setting any nervousness or dread you might have about this present circumstance calm. 1. They could feel the same way about you. Even though you're twin flames, you and your other half probably won't be in line with one another yet. This implies that you probably won't feel what the other is feeling, which is a typical indication of a twin flame association. In this situation, you could simply tell them how you feel. They could feel the same way about you, so there's not a great explanation to pause, isn't that so? I get that you could fear dismissal. Overpowering them is most certainly a valid statement against admitting your feelings. However, imagine a scenario where, bear with me here, Consider the possibility that your twin flame feels the same way about you. Take a risk and find out how it turns out. 2. A skilled guide affirms it. The signs above and beneath will give you a smart thought about whether you should tell your twin flame how you feel. In any case, a reliable method for knowing without a doubt is to talk with a genuine guide. The issue is finding somebody you can trust. There's a wealth of phony specialists out there. However not very many authentic guides who can offer down-to-earth life exhortation. That is why I suggest Mystic Source. They gave me a one-of-a-kind knowledge of where my life should go, including what my identity was intended to be. Having attempted a few web-based guides, I believe they're the most mindful, caring, and proficient organization of talented counsels out there. Not exclusively will a certifiable counselor tell you more about your relationship with your twin flame, yet they can uncover all your adoration prospects. 3. You should be straightforward with your twin flame. Trustworthiness in twin flame connections is critical. On the off chance that you're not being straightforward with your other half about how you truly feel, it could return to cause major problems for you later on. Also, this is positively not something that I'd suggest. No matter what everything's holding you back from saying to them how you feel, whether this is because you believe they're not prepared, or because it's difficult for you to acknowledge your feelings, being straightforward with them is 100% the way forward. It ends up, there's one insured method for seeing whether your twin flame feels the same way about you, and that is telling them. 4. Telling them about your feelings could upgrade your association. The association between twin flames is unique, it's momentary and delightful. However, consider the possibility that something was keeping you away from encountering this association completely. At the point when you tell your twin flame how you truly feel about them, you can work on that association. Trust me when I say that this is one of the most outstanding ways of uncovering a more profound association with your twin flame. 5. Your admission could prompt finding things about one another. This is a major one. While you're keeping away from telling your twin flame how you feel, you might be keeping away from finding things about both of you. Things that could unite you in manners you never imagined. Likewise, you probably won't have insight into as solid an association as you could, because you're keeping down, you won't be aware until you attempt. Only a tad push from your end, and you could find something mind-blowing about your twin flame. 6. You could be harming yourself by keeping yourself down. Question. By not telling your twin flame how you feel, are you passing up adoration? Are you perhaps harming yourself? Yes and yes. Keeping away from telling them how you feel is most certainly going to bring about some sting. Yet, so could tell them. So what's the distinction? One way or the other, you will wind up harming others. However, even if there's only a little opportunity that they could feel the same way about you, and there is because they are your partner, 
why keep them down? In any case, on the off chance that you need greater clarity on this, I'd recommend addressing a talented counselor at Clairvoyant Source. I referenced them before, they have helped me out before, and I've generally tracked down them as legit and humane in their readings, so rather than attempting to tackle all your affection issues all alone, address a counselor who will offer you the responses you're searching for. 7. You shouldn't pick for your twin flame. This individual is your twin soul. Correct? If this is valid, you should regard him adequately her to allow them to pick how to manage the data you're going to give them. You should not be deciding for your twin flame, running against the norm. You should allow your twin flame to settle on their own decisions, and on the off chance that they truly do pick something that you can't help contradicting, that is something different you'll need to manage. You have zero control over your twin flame's decisions about your feelings. Keep in mind, you should never feel liable for telling your twin flame how you feel. They should never cause you to feel liable, all things considered. 8. You shouldn't be reluctant to tell your twin flame how you feel. Telling your twin flame how you feel is perhaps the most frightening thing you'll at any point do. However, I'm here to tell you that there's nothing to fear. You should simply act naturally and be straightforward with them. That is all there is to it. Your twin flame will see the value in the way that you're being straightforward with them, and they'll see the value in your genuineness significantly more, assuming they feel the same way about you. Also, the way that you're telling them how you feel will simply add to the association you share. Furthermore, you should likewise consider how they might have similar apprehensions as you have, because they're fundamentally another you. 9. You can assist them with the enlivening system. Is your twin flame stirred? On the off chance that they are, you could be assisting them with their enlivening cycle. At the point when you tell them how you feel, it could assist them with arousing. However, there's an opportunity that your twin flame isn't stirred in any way, yet, telling them how you feel and showing them exactly how significant they are to you could assist them with arousing. On second thought, you could be the person who assists your twin flame with seeing reality about themselves. 10. You can assist your twin flame with revealing his or her actual self. This is presumably one of my number one twin flame reasons to tell them how you feel. Basically, as a twin soul, you are intended to assist your twin flame with revealing his or her actual self and your admission could cause them to understand specific things about themselves that they didn't know about previously. Models in such a manner are, they might understand things about themselves that they never knew were conceivable. They might understand things about themselves that they never acknowledged were significant. They might understand specific bits of insight about their activities that they believed were correct and great but weren't. Thus, not telling them how you feel isn't generally something to be thankful for. What's more, telling them how you feel isn't generally something worth being thankful for by the same token. However, for your situation, chances are it merits facing the challenge. Is your twin flame additionally your perfect partner? That's what shockingly enough, different specialists say if your twin flame is likewise your perfect partner. You can't deny telling them how you feel, as per them. There's a justification for why you two were matched as twins in any case. And this reason should be something you esteem. If your twin flame isn't likewise your perfect partner, then it very well may be useful for you to know how they feel about you to sort out whether you two are indeed the very same. So how might you at any point realize that you've met the one, your actual perfect partner? Can we just be real? We frequently burn through a great deal of time in feeling about individuals we're not appropriate for. Perceiving your perfect partner isn't direct 100% of the time. In any case, imagine a scenario in which there was a method for eliminating all the mysteries. I've quite recently found a method for doing this. An expert clairvoyant craftsman who can sketch what your perfect partner resembles. Even though I wasn't certain from the start, 
My companion persuaded me to give it a shot half a month prior, presently I know precisely the exact thing my perfect partner seems to be, the insane thing is I've known them for quite a long time, signs your twin flame loves you, before you admit your feelings for your twin soul. You might require some consolation that they feel the same way about you, in this way, here are a few signs that your twin flame loves you, your twin soul is consistently there for you, your twin flame likes to associate with you in any event, while you're feeling down, they care about your prosperity and need to ensure that you're generally blissful and satisfied throughout everyday life, you generally get an uplifting tone around them, your twin flame is a positive individual who is dependably there for you, and assists you with anything that you want, they're very useful and would do anything an option for them to help you, their general energy is very sure, they continually ask how they can help Help. Your twin flame will continually ask you how they can assist with improving your life and more joyful. Also as asking how they might assist with making your life more satisfying. You feel it in your heart when you're around them, they cause your heart to feel warm and fluffy when you're around them. The association between you two is staggering. And each time you're with them, each second feels like an enchantment. It's an indefinable feeling, they need to invest however much energy as could reasonably be expected from you, they love to invest energy with you, in addition to the fact that they like to associate with you, however, they likewise prefer to do a wide range of things together, how would you tell your twin flame how you feel without appearing to be frantic, thus, since it has become so obvious why you should tell your twin flame how you feel, now is the ideal time to discuss what precisely to say. This can be somewhat interesting, since correspondence isn't an area of strength for everybody. Articulating your feelings is certainly not the most straightforward thing to do. Take as much time as is needed to completely communicate what you're feeling. Try not to exclaim it without thinking about it. This could cause you to appear to be frantic. Likewise, if your words sound befuddling, that is presumably how your twin soul will feel too. Confounded, stay away from disarray by obviously saying how you feel. Are you prepared to tell your twin flame how you feel? Ideally, the focus above will reveal insight into whether you should tell your twin flame how you feel. Yet, to know more, I prescribe addressing a certifiable, proficient consultant. Furthermore, there's one organization that I generally wind up suggesting, Mystic Source. Besides the fact that they blew me away with their exact readings, they were likewise kind and comprehended my circumstance. So, if you're worn out on pondering what you should and shouldn't do, reach out to a genuine counsel and assume control over your future. I did, and I've never thought back since.